What is up guys, Get a Given today back with a brand new episode of Skyrim Remastered Mod Showcases on my channel, hope you guys are having a super sick day and today we're going to be looking at the Volkiha Night Vampire Armor. This is absolutely awesome, now I've linked it down in the description below if you guys want it as always. Very simple to get, this one is the standalone one I do believe, there's other different things that obviously go in conjunction with this mod, I'm not going to be doing or listing any of those in this video, if you want to go and check those out then just put in the Volkiha Knight into the Bethesda search engine and it should just appear with loads of different things read up on them as well obviously optional and patches if you guys want those it's fine how to get this armor once you've installed it obviously you're gonna to need to go over to any forge and you can create this in the ebony smithing perk obviously you're gonna need that perk as well so obviously you're gonna need ebony and the ebony smithing perk to unlock ebony if that makes any sense just get the ebony smith perk and you'll be alright so once you've done that you're gonna head over to here Go all the way down to Ebony and go all the way down to obviously where it says the armor like so. So ours is here, the Abyss Walker, not too bad. Heavy armor fast, which is absolutely awesome. It looks really, really nice as well. It's obviously vampire inspired armor and obviously that has armor value of 193, which is actually really quite high. So that's kind of cool and the value of that is 1700 not too bad it's quite higher than other uh, mods that we did have covered before weight 30 is quite lightweight for a heavy arm i'm not gonna lie let's put it down go so we're gonna grab that obviously you can upgrade this one as well i don't actually have the requirements to make this one wisp wrapping i have no idea what they are i believe they're to do with possibly the mod itself but uh that's not too bad as well i think it's just a different color on that one yeah that's fine the assassin one but uh we're gonna go for the abyss walker because why not the boots let's grab those as well I'm a value of 97 or a weight of 5. Now, actually, looking at this as well, it's quite expensive on the requirements to actually make the set of armor. So, if you're going out with your way to grab this amazing armor, make sure you've got a lot of requirements to make it as well. Obviously, we've got the gauntlets as well. Very, very nicely textured and detailed on that. That looks beautiful. The hood as well. Nice little sack hood. Obviously, there's a little bit of detailing on that throughout the seams. So we're going to obviously check that out once we wear it as well. Not too bad on the requirements. And obviously, this one, the Royal Guard very nice very nice let's create that one as well and let's pick between the two possibly the abyss walk is going to be my favorite but uh who knows so let's have a look at this beautiful armor in the sunlight let's obviously go along and equip it now so obviously going to get the gauntlet uh, not the not the gauntlets the uh, chest piece on first we're going to put the boots and we're going to go for the gauntlets with the hood. Now, I'm just seeing it straight off the bat, armor value rating around, all round is 423. It's absolutely insane for the membrane. That is an insane armor value. That is ridiculously high. That is absolutely beautiful. And we haven't even upgraded it as well, so that is awesome. So let's have a cheeky, quick look at this straight from the back as well. Very nicely detailed and textured. The blue is very good. Whoa, it looks freaking all. Oh, that looks terrifying. Nice little brooch there near the chest. The hood is absolutely awesome. The guy that's actually got the, in the thumbnail as well, he's actually got a uh, character that pretty much looks like a vampire. All the uh, sort of um, staining from the eyes are coming down. Red eyes in itself. Just looks freaking damn terrifying. My character does not look terrifying at all. But uh, it looks absolutely awesome. It's a beautiful set of armor textured all the way through as well. I'm just going to check the other color as well. See if what well, that's like the red. Oh, the red might persuade me. I do like the red, especially at night time as well. Corresponds with that vampire sort of feel, obviously, to do with the blood as well. But that looks really damn nice. I am enjoying the red one. I'm a fan of that. There's just so many little bits of detailing on this. I can't actually cover all of it, even straight from the boots, which are absolutely beautiful, by the way. I don't know if you can see those, but they look freaking damn awesome. It moves so fluent as well really really nice but it's just the pouches the satchels the belts the cloth even like even if just like the little things even if you just look at the stitching so for instance like the stitching mainly near the waist area it's just absolutely insane i've taken a lot of time to do this i personally think this looks absolutely beautiful that's really 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 nice and you could do it with so many different builds as well. I mean, it's not that heavy in weight, but obviously it is a heavy armor. But the armor value is absolutely disgusting for a base damage. I wonder if we can upgrade it as well. Oh my god, you can. That is that is horrific. I wonder what it's going to be like once uh, we uh, crank everything on it. It's going to be insane. I mean, even just the chest itself is 1,053 just for the arm. What is our armor va re value rating now? 2,573 that is awful man that might be like one of the top five 
armor values that we've covered on the channel as well to do with Skyrim Special Edition. That is absolutely insane. Guys, for the last couple of minutes now of this video, what we're going to be doing is heading off into combat and seeing what this beautiful armor can do and display for us in combat. Cannot wait to see what it has to offer and see how well it flows as well. Very, very nice. But that's all from me, guys. Let me know what you think in the comment section below of this armor. I really, really do like it. It just looks so clean as well. You can use it with so many different builds. I am still contemplating that as well, guys. So obviously, you've made it this time after the video. Please let me know if you want to see some build-inspired mod that's in conjunction with, obviously, spells, armors, and weapons all combined into one video to make a, I suppose you could call it a class video. Then uh, let me know about that in the comment section below. But guys, thanks ever so much for watching. It really does mean a lot to me, and I really do appreciate it. Until the next one, guys, kill a cafe and kill a cafe out.